What's up guys, it's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Crystal Walkthrough. Okay, so we finally made it to Vermilion City, and remember guys, we're in Pokemon Crystal, of course, this is three years after the events of Pokemon Red, Blue, and Yellow, and for those in Japan, Green. And uh, lots, of lot, lots of changes here in the Kanto region, I mean, lots of changes that we didn't really notice, like somebody took my, my, championship, my championship belt, that's one of the things. The other thing, too, is that, yes, uh, there's no Squirtle Squad here. There's a lot of uh, toxicity or something, uh, Grimers and all that stuff. I don't know. Let's go ahead and take a tour of uh, Vermilion City. You talk to this guy. He's like, I am the fishing dude, the elder, uh, elder of the fishing bros. Have you met the fishing guru at Lake of Rage? Heck yes. He dreams, uh, or he dreams about seeing the world's greatest Magikarp. If you don't mind, could you show him any Magikarp you catch? Huh, pretty much. Who knows? You, you may catch the Magikarp of his dreams. Yeah, maybe. I don't know. I might. I don't know. I, I, I thought he was going to give me like another rod, but initially that, that guy gave me the old rod back in the Pokemon Yellow. Now talk to her. She's like, Vermilion Port is Kanto Seaside Gateway. Luxury liners from around the world dock here. Hmm. Hey, would you look at that? It's the guy that was supposed to make a... Well, really, Wade? Seriously? Okay, I don't need to hear from you. I don't care. You bought some berries, whatever. Okay, he wants to share some with me. I don't care. Wade, I'm in Kanto right now. Um, so here's the guy that was trying to make a building right here with his Machop. Look at that. The guy's still stomping right. Oh, wow. He is growl. Oh, wow. He's stomping. Of wow. He is a strong Pokemon right there. Talk to this guy. He's like, my Pokemon is preparing the land for construction, but I have no money to start the project. Oh, that's kind of sad. Hmm. And right here, Vermilion City, the port of exquisite sunsets. Huh. Okay. All right. And we got our Pokemon. I think there's like a Pokemon fan club right here. Maybe this is no. This is not the fan club. Do you know about the Magnet Train? It's a railway that goes to Goldenrod in Johto. You don't say. And this guy is like, I want to go Saffron to see the Magnet Train. Okay. Alrighty. Okay. So, let's see. Where do we go next? Talk to this guy. There are eight gyms in Kanto. That big building in Ver is Vermilion City's uh, Pokemon gym. Ha! Huh. You don't say. And if you go right here, you find a uh, full heal. That's that's the funny thing right there. Okay, so we'll visit you in just a little bit. And like I was talking about earlier on, is this is the fan club. All Pokemon are welcome. Okay, we should go in here. I remember my Pikachu got a lot of cr real crazy when you saw a Pokemon right here. And uh, let's see right here. It's a Clefairy? Huh? Oh, right. It's a Clefairy doll. Hmm. You look a little familiar. You look familiar. I'm keeping my eyes on you. Talk to this guy. He's like, I love Clefairy the way Clefairy waggles its finger when it's trying to use its metronome. It's so adorable. Okay. And if you talk to this guy, he's like, the I'm the chairman of the Pokemon fan club. I've raised over 150 Pokemon. I'm very fuzzy when it comes to Pokemon. Did you visit... Or did you visit to hear about my Pokemon? Ah, God, I really don't want to. I really don't want to hear it, but you know what? I have to, because he's probably going to give us something. I don't know. Yes, good! Then listen up. So, my favorite Pokemon, Rapidash. It's cute, lovely, smart, unbearably, plus amazing. Oh, you think so? Too much. Wild, beautiful, kindly, love it. Sounds like a haiku. Hug it. When sleeping, warm and cuddly. Oh, and spectacular. Ravishing, simply divine. Oops, look at the time. I kept you I kept you too long. You really did. Thanks for hearing me out. I want you to have this. He gives us a rare candy. Alright, cool. Cool rare candy. Alright. Thanks, buddy. It's a rare candy. That makes Pokemon stronger. I prefer making my Pokemon stronger by battling so you can have it. Don't we all, homeboy? Don't we all? Okay, so I don't need you talk to you anymore. And let's see what this lady right here has to say. I don't know, something nice about this guy. Our chairman is very vocal when it comes to Pokemon. You don't say. Okay, that's enough of that. What else do we need to do right here? Oh, let's go right here. I, this, this is the place where we got that Farfetch'd, or where farfetch you can get. This guy's like, over many years, Diglett dug a large tunnel. That tunnel goes uh, to a distant town. No, you don't say. Huh. 
Okay, let, let, let's go and check that, uh, that, 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 that place. And if you talk to this guy, he's like, Skilled trainers gather in Kanto. Gym leaders are especially strong. They won't be easy to defeat. Hmm. And, uh, whoa. Would you look at that? That's a... That's a big old Pokemon. That is a... That is a doozy of a Pokemon. Snorlax is snorling peacefully. Okay, so we can't go anywhere right now. I guess we have to go to a Pokemon gym, I guess. Yes, guys. Now, we do need the cut technique right here, but we can bypass all of that by using the surf technique because, hey, you know what? We don't need the cut technique. Look at that. Look at that, man. Okay, so go here. The, the Vermilion City gym, Pokemon Gym. Leader, Lieutenant Surge, the Lightning American. All right, so he's very American, I guess. Now, talk to this guy. He's like, yo, champ in the making. You looked out this time. Lieutenant Surge is very cautious. He has traps set all over the gym, but <laughs> the traps aren't working or are, aren't active now. You'll have no problem getting to the Lieutenant Surge. You don't say. I'm, I'm happy about this one. Apparently, there's a blackout here in, uh, in Kanto. So, we have an easy passage to Lieutenant Surge. So... I think I'm going to battle all these guys and you know what? Make them my, you know, who. Um, let's see, let's see, let's see. Who is, uh, oh wait, I don't have a ground type Pokemon, huh? No, yeah. <laughs> Lucky's in the PC. Okay, start battling. Maximum effort. Here we go. I'm going to take you down. Prepare to be shocked. And if you guys can't hear, the music. Sounds pretty badass. We're in Kanto right now. So our first battle in Kanto, we're taking on Juggler Horton, and he's going to be coming out with his Electrode. Oh yeah, that sounds like an electric type Pokemon, but here's my Teddy. Teddy's going to kick your butt with Earthquake. And uh, there goes that Sonic Boom first, because of course, electric type Pokemon are pretty fast. Oh yeah. Yeah, you're not loving that. You are not loving the Earthquake attack right there. And uh, there goes Electrode. Down for the count. And Teddy grows to level 46. That's awesome. And did you guys see his attack? It's pretty powerful. It's ridiculous. And, uh, huh. I'm gonna go with Cinder. I'm gonna go with Cinder. Just because Cinder's awesome. It's pretty cool. You know, it's my first Pokemon in, in Crystal. You know, I don't. I, I want to give him some loving right here with a dig attack. Yeah, try and get me right now, Electrode. That's right. And this guy's gonna go for a rollout, but he misses! So here we go with Dig Attack. Kinda sounds like Gig Attack. Giga Tank. I don't know. And uh, Kid Thunder still growing experience points without doing anything, and the guy wants to go with another Electrode, so let's stick with Relic right here. Yeah, Relic is gonna go all oh, nuts on this guy. Super nuts. That's right. Here we go, Psychic Attack. You know, Psychic Attack in this Pokemon generation really, really, I really love this one because it's just it's crazy. It's like a, it's like a super laser sonic beam, you know, that kind of stuff. And he has another Electrode. Okay, all right. Uh, who wants to take on Electrode? I am not going to use, uh, yeah, let's go back to Teddy. Going back to Teddy right here and, uh, well, let's see what uh, Electrode number four can do with an Earthquake attack. Oh, God. So that's all you can do. Sonic Boom. Take 20 HP away from me right there and then. You have a sad existence of a life. And uh, there goes that Earthquake. There goes Electrode. That's a knockout right there. That's right. And, uh, <laughs> okay, so Kid Thunder is at level 51. I probably should switch that whole thing up right there. Ah! I was overpowered. Yes, you were. Okay. Um, Kid Thunder has already gotten to level 51. I need to take that item away. And who needs the item more than... Uh, I'm going to go with Teddy right here because... You know what? Nessie can get to a level 50 real easily. But this guy... This guy right here. Teddy. Teddy's a, a, a Pokemon that, you know, needs some work. And let's use... Okay, I, I'm... I'm tempted to use that rare, the rare candy right there. Let's see what Nessie has right now. Okay, has a ways away to level 48. Right? And Teddy right here. Okay. Okay, I think I found the Pokemon I'm going to give that rare candy to. 
Teddy. Alrighty, so we're on par right here with Nessie. Let's go and battle some other person. Oh, I'm gonna look inside here. Nope, nothing but trash. <laughs> and this guy right here is coming up, and he's like, Lieutenant Surge recognized my potential with electric Pokemon. Think you can beat me? I know I can beat you. You think you can beat me? I'm just saying, you know. Okay, he guitars Vincent wants the battle, and uh, he's sending out his Magnemite right here. Okay, bring it on. Okay, here we go. Mm, oh wait, does Magnemite? I want to. Okay, let's see if Earthquake works right here. Oh, it does. Okay, so generate up to Generation Two. I completely forgot about that one. Okay, if you guys don't know. I thought it still had the levitate thing. You know, thought that was gonna work. And, uh, well, he's coming out with his Voltorb. I'm going to continue on right here with Teddy. Teddy's going to just dominate the crap out of everybody right here. I'm going to go with a return. Save up on those Earthquakes because, yeah, we're going to be using this guy for, uh, for Lieutenant Surge. And, uh, that, that's powerful. Teddy's just a powerful beast of a Pokemon. You know, awesome. He's awesome sauce. And, you know what? He's coming out with Steel-type Pokemon. Cinder needs to destroy Okay, alrighty, let's go. Let's bring it on. Bring it on, Magnemite, you jerk of a Pokemon. Right here. Fire Punch. Flame Punch. Something Punch. Hot Cheetos Punch. You know, I'm just naming names. That kind of stuff. Because I can. Hmm. And Teddy's just growing and growing. And uh, he's coming out with another Magnemite. So I'm going to stay put right here. Let's go with Magnemite right here. All right, let's go. Fire Punch. That Fire Punch is gonna do so much damage. Look at that. Bye bye. Bye bye, Magnemite. Oh yes. Oh yes. I I'm loving it. I, I really am. Just beating this guy. He's like, oh, how shocking. Very shocking right here. And uh, we got one more dude to go. And uh, who? Okay, Relic. You know what? You need to battle. You need to battle. You whore of a Pokemon. And. Uh, this guy right here is going to be like, you're here to fe defeat Lieutenant Surge? Not if I have to, or I can help it. Okay. So we got a non-believer. Bring it on. This guy right here is coming out. His name is Gregory, and he's coming out with his Pikachu. Oh, he's got a Pikachu right here. That Pikachu is level 37. That's cool. Look at that Pikachu. I like Pikachu. How come we can't catch Pikachu at, uh, in Johto? I want to know. I really do. Well, you can get a Pikachu through a Pichu, but I got lucky enough to get an elect, uh, elect kid. I don't know. Best of both worlds, I don't know. And he's coming out with his Flaffy. We're gonna stay. And this guy comes out with his Flaffy. Look at that, his light bulb go turning on, and I'm gonna go with that Shadow Ball right there. Shadow Ball finishes off that Flaffy. Critical hit. That's good. That's great. That's awesome. That's gravy sauce right there. And, uh... Well, he's like, sorry, I failed you, Lieutenant Surge, sir. Oh, wow. Military style, huh? He's like, when I was still in the army, Lieutenant Surge saved my life. Oh, you're that dude. You're that dude. Okay. <laughs> That's right, Lieutenant Surge. It's just you and me. Okay, we're going to switch it up to my Teddy because Teddy is missing you. And here we go. He's like, hey, you little tyke. I have... I have to hand it to you. It may not be a very smart to challenge me, but it takes guts. When it comes to electric type Pokemon, I am number one. I've never lost on a battlefield. I'll zap you just like I did in my enemies in the war. Seriously, what war? Oh, God. You don't remember me, Lieutenant Search. All right, let's do this. And I love this gym leader, this gym leader music right here. You see, do you hear that? So here we are, our ninth gym battle, uh, gym battle against Guile himself, Lieutenant Surge. All right, so he's coming out with his Raichu, and this guy, look at that, he's a little plumpy. He's at level 44. I'm coming out with Teddy because Teddy can do this, faint attack. And that's one thing they, well, they like to do is they like to paralyze you, which is kind of annoying for me. A, I seem to be a victim of that. Let's go with the earthquake. And uh, there's that paralysis. And uh, here we go with an earthquake attack. There goes that Raichu. Oh yes. 
Oh yeah. I'm loving that one because, you know what, we defeated him easily with that guy. Okay, so I seem to have, forgot, to have forgotten something right here. He's coming out with his electrode. I'm going to stay with Teddy right here. I forgot something, guys. So he comes out with an electrode. And, uh, well, let's switch up to the next screen right here. <laughs> yeah, I completely forgot about that, guys. Okay, so here's Lieutenant Surge three years later. And uh, let me just check on Bulbapedia right here. Okay, hold on. Hold on, guys. I'm sorry. I am very, very sorry. Lieutenant Surge, you jerk. Okay. Lieutenant Surge, LT, Surge. And come on. Come on, Internet. There we go. I'm pressing on it. Bulbapedia, why you have to be such a little, you know what. Okay, so here we are. Lieutenant Surge, the electric type gym leader. Now, if you remember... In Pokemon Red, Blue, and Yellow, or in Red and Blue, he did have a Voltorb, Pikachu, Raichu, on their level 20s. Pokemon Yellow, he only had a Raichu at level 28. Now, here we are in Pokemon Gold, Silver, and Crystal. He does have five Pokemon. He started off with his, his Raichu, which, of course, we defeated. Level 44, he comes out with, mm, let's see, two Electrodes that are at level 40. We got a Magneton, level 40, and a Electabuzz. Which is at level 46. Remember, these Pokemon are like type Pokemon. They're fast. They like to use paralysis moves such as Thunder, uh, Thunder Wave, Zap Cannon, Thunder Punch, Thunder, or Thunderbolt. Um, Pokemon like Electrode are fast. They like to use Screech, Double uh, Team, or Explosion. So just be aware of that. Now, going back to this screen right here, let's go with that Earthquake attack right here. And, well, like I said before, that Double Team does something right here. Its evasion went up, and it will not escape that Earthquake because... Why not? Teddy. Teddy's awesome. Even if it's paralyzed, Teddy is still awesome. So there we go. Electrode defeated like that. And, uh, of course, that experience here is doing miracles to this Teddy Pokemon. And uh, it's coming out with a Magneton. So I'm going to switch it up to Cinder right here. Give him some loving. That's right. Do you guys dare me to battle my elect Electabuzz with his Electabuzz? I want to know. Too late. I'm going to do it. Bad decisions right now. Flame Wheel Attack for the win right here. Now remember, Magneton is also a Steel-type Pokemon, so you can beat him with a Fire-type Pokemon. You know, you guys can do that. Or Ground-type Pokemon, whatever. You know, we're still in Generation 2. There goes Magneton. Defeated. That's right, look at that. My Pokemon are just kicking butt right now. And Tenant Surge coming out with his Electrode. I'm gonna go back, or you know what? I'm gonna give a little love into uh, Relic right here, because, you know, Teddy Ursa, or Ursarang, it's a little paralyzed doesn't want to be battling anymore and I'm gonna use that special move that I love psychic for psychic bye bye come on finish him off finish him off yes defeated fatality that's right fatality and Teddy is just gaining more experience points and he's coming out with his electabuzz so let's do this kid thunder versus kid thunder that's right Bring it on, Electabuzz. That's the male version. Here's my Kid Thunder. That's right. Bring it on. All right. So let's go with the light screen first. You know, I'm, I'm trying. I'm gonna play. I'm gonna play him at his own game right here. He's gonna try and use a thunder like you see. See? Does it? Oh wow! It does a lot of damage. It was a critical hit. Okay, you jerk. Iron Tail. That's right. You didn't think of that. You didn't see that coming, right? Oh, wasn't that effective? Okay. All right. His defense failed, but he's going with that light screen. Okay, so we're playing we're playing that game. We're being that guy. So we're gonna be thunder punching away right here. Oh uh, yeah. Oh wow. And that's right. You're paralyzed, you jerk. That's right. And there's that thunder attack. Please do not make me faint. No. I got a physical move right here with Iron Tail. Come on. Let's go with the let's go, Kid Thunder. And uh, would you look at that? Say goodbye to his Electabuzz. My Kid Thunder kicked your ass. That's right. And Teddy grows to level 48. That's great. And uh, would you look at that? Lieutenant Surge was defeated. He's like, oh, you're too strong. Okay, kid, you get the Thunder Badge. That's right. So here it is, guys. We got ourselves our first badge in Kanto. Badge number nine. And look at that. It's been a while. Thunder Badge increases Pokemon speed. Consider it proof that you defeated me. You wear it proudly. Here, 
Hey, aren't you gonna give me a TM or something? Hey, kid. Still slugging and, and chugging away? My Pokemon and I are still at it. Well, that's one thing in Generation 2. You will not get any kind of TMs from these Pokemon Gym Leaders, but you will get the distinction right here of, you know, defeating them. Of course, I defeated them a second time, and this guy's like, whoa, that was an electrifying bout. It sure made me nervous. All right. Glad you liked it. Um, okay. So that is badge number nine, and uh, we got ways to go here now. There are other gyms that we can go to. Um, we can head up north. And straight up go to Saffron City. Um, shoot, there's a lot of things to do here, so stay tuned, guys. Tomorrow there will be another episode of Pokemon Crystal, and you guys will love it. I'll see you guys in a few hours. I don't know. I'll see you guys later. See you guys.